Hello guys, welcome to my boring lecture about spatial data. So this is also known as the geospatial data because it stores uh, the information about a location by its longitude and latitude. Uh, as you can see, there are many types of data type uh, in the, inside the spatial data. Uh, so geometry is basically stored, I mean, it stores longitude and latitude, but it's actually on a spherical surface which has been flattened out. It's like a 3D map which is projected on a flat surface. So basically that's it. Uh, the point is an industry guide pointer by which you will actually point out things but it will have only two two data, like two integers, like five, three. You can point it out like that. And line string is uh, when you want to show a path, like uh, you have traveled from Dhaka to Chittagong. If your GPS is on, GPS tapper, and you have pointed out in a few, I mean, you have uh, put it the longitude and latitude all over your, uh, I mean, your ways. You have pointed out that you pass this point and that point and that point to take now. So when you uh, we use it the use the line string and the longitude and uh, the latitude and longitude which you have pointed out you will get a like a certain map you will get a road shape map which you have pointed out using the latitude and longitude and polygon is like uh, when you want to point out an area you know like uh, the area of IUB campus if you have the uh, longitude and latitude of the side of the surfaces, I mean uh, of the side of the area of IUB and if you can put it out in the polygon, it will just give you out a shape of the IUB, I mean the area which IUB is occupied on. So these are basically the important parts. There are also the other uh, points like multi points, multi line strings, multi polygon but it's uh, these are all based on this main four things so this are about it. so thank you for listening and hope this was something see ya hi guys my name is akash and today i will be talking about the special data type of this uh, mysql server so this is a data type which is also known as the geospatial data type because it stores the geographical information of something Okay, it stores like the longitude and latitude, uh, the location, it produces a graph, map, whatever you want it to do. I mean, it's a very important data type which you can use on uh, various purposes. So, the geometry, uh, the geometry is actually a data type which can store the value of any type of geometrical, uh, geometrical positions, like it can store the point type, it can store the um, longitude and latitude, uh, basically it's like the mother of everything. So you can store all, all kinds of geometrical value this uh, on this data type and it produces something like this, I mean uh, imagine a 3D map on a flat surface of the world, of this, of this planet Earth. If you can imagine it, then you can uh, point, it, point out the location of this geometry easily. It's actually uh, producing a map on a spherical surface which has been uh, which is flattened out so it's like a 3d map projected on a flat surface uh, the point the point is an industry gate uh, system which you can use to point out the location of something it uses maximum two integers or uh, not maximum i mean it uses it usually uses two integer points to locate uh, to to point out the location of something uh, sorry about this one my stupid idea. So next is the line string. The line string is very simple and it is used for various purposes. You can use the line string to produce a road map. I mean if you're going from Dhaka to let's say Tekna uh, and if you point out the longitude and latitude on different points of the path you can produce a map using this line string which will give you a road map from Dhaka to Tekna. Uh, the next is polygon. Polygon is like producing it produces an area of something let's say if you want to pro see the area of IUB all you have to do is give the boundary location of IUB uh, using the longitude and latitude or any other kind uh, I mean I think it's longitude and latitude so if you give the uh, boundaries using that type of data in polygon it will produce you a area uh, in which the IUB is located 
in this map in the in the world map so that's basically about all this type and multi point multi liners uh, multi polygon are just basically the multiple use of these and geometry collection is uh, when you're using all of these in a single let's say in a single form for a mega location of something i mean if you want to show something bigger then this geometry collection is used but it's uh, a lot for fetch thing so i will not go into that it's basically an interaction so these are something like that let's say what you can do with it i mean as i said you can generate a road map from dhaka to treknav it can be from anywhere to anywhere yeah as long as your gps uh, is uh, on and you can produce the uh, longitude and latitude longitude and latitude and then let's say in industrial purposes i am entering uh india i'm entering india so what products should be available to me or what products i can have and at which offer all those things will be uh will be generated by the location where i am in so in that case the sp the special data will come in handy it will generate the that i am in this location so this place has this kind of offers to uh, offers to offer me so that will be the key point of this uh, in in industry gate system i mean it's a, not a key point it can be used as a point in a industrial system so that's about it for today hopefully it wasn't boring and it didn't kill you so see you next time